Hey, this is Frank Burke with Dinosaur Rocketry, and um, today I've got my new version of this particular kit. Um, this is roughly based on the piggyback portion of the orbital transport rocket kit from the 60s that I've upscaled three and a half times to uh, 2.6 inch diameter tubing. Um, this iteration I've gone to the pointier nose cone, which I think looks a little more aerodynamic. And um, the decals are very representative of the original. Um, this one's 29 inches long, uh, 20 and a half inch wingspan. It's got just a little bit of dihedral, and it's running Elevon controls for roll and pitch. And this is designed for the E6 uh, long burn motor, like uh, my other kits. And um, this particular one weighs just a little over nine ounces, ready to fly. And um, it's a really nice flying model. This one is, uh, I've changed the name to the Orbital Starliner. And um, the new decals that you can order from Sticker Shock will say Orbital Star Lines, um, just to differentiate it from the Estes kit. And um, I think you'll like it. It's very simple. It goes together in about uh, an hour and a half, including putting the radio in. So super, super quick and easy. Okay. All right, this is the Dinosaur Rocketry Orbital Starliner. Flying on an Aerotech E6. Taking off in five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, that was a long burn. Nice. Oh, that was just about perfect, too. In this lighting, I think it's going to disappear. These are all just, I mean, they're all nearly identical, so they should find out. It's always nice when they do. Mm -hmm. yeah. I kind of like this with the pointy nose. 